right, we are back at it. What's up, guys? How's it going? Mark from 408. We're in the last ride. Last of the, ride. Of the GMC. Yeah, I'm on a helicopter hunt. Right yeah, now. we just had a, a spring helicopter fly over, but then he disappeared. So, last ride. Are we going to, I think we should whip some donuts on this thing. <laughs> Big old burnout. I don't know. Hey, send that to the dealer after? Yeah, let's just send her in there. Uh, easy. Maybe I'll put a few bucks gas in it. Or at least rev it up or something. I imagine we run out of gas right now. Uh, anyways, yeah, she was quite the long weekend. Uh, I didn't really film anything. I just posted stories and stuff. We did uh, three cottages and four nights. So first night we swung up and saw Brad the gang. He tried to ruin my life and beat me with fish. So that's you know what, fish thanks, or fishing. Thanks for donating your 20 bucks to the fishing Yeah, 2069. <laughs> so who won? Uh, well, Greg's in the lead, but it goes until everybody leaves. Oh, so it's still another so, week. Yeah, the long, I think it's now two weeks. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 So, but uh, muck got a musky. Oh, right, did he? Right in front of the cottages. <laughs> like, why weren't we casting for musky right now? Not a clue. Yeah. Anyways, so yeah, we did that. And uh, Friday, we went up to Bracebridge uh, in Muskoka there, visited some friends. And Sunday, on our way home, we swung by Bayfield to my grandma's cottage. And saw my family I haven't seen in a couple of years because couple of them live at west so she was fun she was good so this week hopefully we jump some cars and uh do some burnouts so they can go burn the quad tires off it's quad tire burning season is that thing when's the last time that thing's been started probably in the winter when we probably were since i was on it in the winter yeah you were in dallas don't let him touch I'm gonna that thing. don't let him touch that <laughs> no that's fine yeah. uh it's ours <laughs> okay <laughs> Uh, but yeah, right now Brad is going to, well, we are going to pick up a new vehicle for Brad. Just threw an orange peel at me. Yeah, I saw that freaking Mario Kart. So we're headed to Exeter to, what's the dealer? Exeter Dodge. Exeter Dodge. I'm not sure if there's a different name for it, but it's a Dodge dealership in Exeter. Uh, are you and getting the, one. we don't, we're not going to tell you no. what you're getting. I'm obviously sure you've seen it in the thumbnail already, so. It's Destroyer Gray. <sighs> but yes. he's out of the truck gang. But for a little bit, we'll see. We'll road see. trips are going to be unreal. He keeps saying this because yeah. it fits like white eight people, yeah. like twenty six. But people. I feel like you're just going to be like, yeah, I don't want to drive. Yeah, no, I know. I've don't been want drinking. To, I don't really. I've had drive. too many beers. Yeah. I'm usually the one that wants to drive because I don't <laughs> drive 180 kilometers an hour. I just cruise, no tickets. No problem. Just cruise. So. All right, well, let's get here and uh, check her out. Maybe we'll swing by Country Corners and see the Sherp dealership check as well. Shirts. Gas is expensive. Look at the freaking random number Brad put in there. $14.71. Last fill up in this little girl. Not even a fill. That's what it takes to fill it up. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I bet the needle didn't even move. Is that six, all the change you I'll have in your six, pocket? I'll get six kilometers. In. That's all the change you have. <laughs> yeah. You probably won't even be able to start it up with that amount. Uh, all right. Look at her. Ooh, ooh, ooh. This is the first time I've seen her. Look really? at thing. She is a shining. Look at it. You got 12 cans of tire shine on there. <laughs> Good. That's how Brad likes to run it. She's a hemi. Hope you like paying thing. for gas. What's that? Hope you like paying oh, for gas. gas <laughs> Not the way you're going to drive it. <laughs> uh. All right. And see you guys there. Look at this thing. Never got sick of that smell. I know. Something. A bigger screen now. Ready? Yeah. You want to go back to the exhaust? I'm fine. Here? Okay. Vroom. Look at this. It's going to take some getting used to this thing. Yeah. Uh, lots of room for activities back there. Yeah, what's she look like? Yeah, uh, there's seats in the back, right? Yeah. They flip up. Oh, got some uh, charger phone, yeah. bigger screen, no sunroof club, just how we like it. I don't think I've ever been in a new Durango. I've jumped a bunch of old ones. What is the name of this dealership? I don't even know. Exeter Dodge, we'll call it. <clears throat> She's an RT. What? Where's your trailer hitch, Brad? I think it's in there. It's in there. Oh, it's just covered it's just up? Yeah. That's how we do it here. So if you want it off, it's just uh, take a quarter. Put this, this 
twist these off. Actually, these don't even have a quarter. Do you always carry a quarter just for that I, reason? Just yeah. for this reason. Oh, okay, yeah. since so. There's like that. There you go, wow. Simple, right? Fancy. Nice and clean. Well, it just hides it when you're oh, yeah, using it. Oh, yeah, for sure. Sweet. Well, let's go take her for a rip. Oh, it's a little <laughs> Now you can say yes. Yes, it is a Hemi. It's a Hemi. Yeah. yeah. I think Nick will be pleased, eh? He's got the SRT. Uh, oh, yeah, he's got, got a, the he's got a Jeep on. one. He's got the track on. Yeah. Oh, 700 horse. Yeah. Yeah, and I think he bumped it up to like 900 or. Oh, yeah. That's, so. that's cool. Too fast. Lido. Looks good. Let's go drag racing. For now. Yeah, it's All right, first rip. Here we go. Let's take that detour and some gravel. Jeez, why, oh, oh. why are you beating on it? Just all right? easy. Just we're yeah. getting into it. Are we getting a burger first? Let's get a burger. Let's get some food on this. But that's our first trip Let's over to AW. That first thing I worry about in vehicles is always crank up your equalizer. No, you want I don't. the base, no. all the travel, some mid action. Yeah, what are we doing? Are we doing KFC or Burger King? There's no KFC here. There's KFC right there. Oh, that's Wendy's. You know what I need? I need, some, Pizza Hut. I need some bar oil for my DeWalt. Bar oil. That's what I need. Get some bar oil all over this thing. Uh, oh, yeah, the mid. That was the only thing I didn't turn up in my truck because I have a speaker right here and it like makes my ears ring. It's weird. The mid. The mid. Look at this. We're in too much shade. We need sun to park in here. So when you got a brand new vehicle, you're allowed to take up two spots. It's the law. Is that the law? It's the law. Okay. Yeah. Yeah, this get, get your journey out of the way. Get your journey. I still don't understand why people buy single cab trucks. Yeah, it's it's like a two door car. Useless. Where? Yeah, I know. I don't understand why. They might as well just sell it. Alright, let's swing by Ford and get a real vehicle. Are you going in? <laughs> <laughs> Buddy burgers. Best thing for you. No veggies, no problem. What do you got? Walk us through it. Pizza awesome. review. What did I get? You got teen burger. Teen burger. I got cheese, bacon, and lettuce. The essentials. So I'm gonna go travel the world, get cheese, bacon, and lettuce on my burger. Oh, speak out, we can't hear you. And I'm gonna let you know which one. Who's the best? One bite? I'll tell you what they have a good thing going here. Their seasoning is incredible. A1? No, A1. A1. A1 sauce? No, A1, like incredible. That's confusing. <laughs> Sorry, A1 sauce. It's confusing in the food industry. I went with Sprite. Sprites, I don't drink pop in general, but for some reason, when I first came to AW as a kid, I got Sprite. So it's the only thing I get here now. Do you know what we should have done? Except I, I don't drink pop. I should have said, give me some fries, throw some AW seasoning on the fries. Oh. That would be unbelievable. Or Harmon Ranch. We're at a restaurant the other night. I got a thing of ranch, a thing of parm. You dip them in the ranch, you dip them in the parm. A little seasoning on top. No, I'm not gonna do that. No. I'm not gonna do that. I'm a seasoning guy. It used to no, be I'm way more fun. Sauce guy. <laughs> well, I'll be the sauce guy. You can I'll be the seasoning You can be the seasoned vet over there. We'll never mix together. Also, what's the H stand for under Durango? Yeah. Can't really see it from Can't see right now. There's an H under Durango. Let's think about it first. Is it because it's a hemi? Probably. It might be because it's a Hemi. But YouTubers will let us know though. Yeah, Thanks guys, we're gonna eat. See you in a few. And of course, we had to swing by Country Corners here to look at this beast because they have the trailer now. I've only seen the trailer on obviously social media. So I don't know many details about it. All I know is it's powered and it's it likes powered, to party. It's a flat bed. How come frickin' King Boss Quad doesn't have one of these yet? Yeah. You know Nick. What? Get the trailer. Grow, grow up and get the trailer. <laughs> For how many people you're hauling around, get the trailer. Wait a second. Look at this thing. Oh, it smells, eh? Yeah. We're Freshy, right. burning. Maybe we'll break her in a little bit. Yeah. Oh, man. But yeah, imagine having the flat deck and then putting like a, a boom on here. You could pick up machines, put them on top, take them to the dump. Oh, she's PTO driven. There you go. I didn't even know these things had PTOs. It's a lot of expensive tires, I'll tell you that. Oh, here we go. Photo shoot. Here. Are you videoing? You want me in it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 Let's get to it. 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 Let's get to it.
I got a title. Thanks for buying me this one. <laughs> yeah, clickbait. And then we got the other Sherps, the Sherp Pro XT. These things are way bigger. Wildly way bigger. I'm just gonna stand beside the tire here. I'm a little bigger. It's a little bigger than that one, eh, Brad? Just stand beside the tire. I'm, I'm a foot taller than you. No, you're not. I'm taller than you. Hey, yeah. for a base price of 167.9. That's for. That's Canadian as well, not American. Here's all your specs if you want to pause it and read it. Oh, you optional air conditioning, folding seats. Is there the price on there? Yeah, oh, base, God. that's base price. You know what, look at these guys. They see somebody pulling a brand new Durango, looking at shirts, they should be out here thinking, oh, we got buyers. They just see, oh, it's Mark and Brad, they don't give a, yeah, yeah. they don't give a tip. They're like, no thanks. <laughs> yeah, nope, nope. Well, inside view for you. No, we really need in life is an Argo. Oof. Now some fun on an Argo. All right. Yeah, that, that one is a little small, right? It's just a little farm farm shirt. Yeah, it's just a little farm truck. Yeah. Wow. All right. Well, let's. Uh, AC in the roof, eh? Yeah. Nick needs that. I think it's only a ten thousand dollar option. Pocket chains. Yeah. Pocket chains. Pocket chains. Pocket chains. Yeah. All right, let's uh let's get out of here. Go some fun. Mr. Drum. All right, we got some freshy Durango shots. There you go. Oh, hey, hey. Yeah. Okay, see ya. Yeah, see you later. Take care. Definitely warm out here today. Truck needs a wash. I just did a big uh, almost 1,000K tour this weekend. So much fun. We went up to, to Buckhorn Lake on Thursday visit brad and the gang and then we went up to uh, bracebridge muskoka there friday i didn't post any stories though. i was off my phone the whole weekend didn't really want people to know where i was so no stories no problem and it was nice to have a little digital relaxation so back of the farm now it is 29 today going to 30 humid no clouds in the sky well there is way 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 over there but nothing nothing here so we got a couple shipments i got my new watch band Obviously, I just bought this on my own. It's from Amazon. It's called Subcase. If you have an Apple Watch and you like to smash it off walls, like me, I would highly recommend it. 25 bucks, best 25 bucks that you can spend to save your $600 watch. And it's raised as well. Well, it's listening to me right now. So yeah, this it's raised to protect the screen. So feels good, looks good. It's listening to me again. Quit listening to me, phone. So we got a couple shipments this week. Nothing too crazy. This one isn't actually that exciting. So uh, recently we picked up Warren winches. So they are the top winches in the league, uh, you know, for trucks, Jeeps, any off-roading, side-by-side. So I have a Warren winch on mine right now and I'm gonna have a fresh one coming. They are a little back-ordered though. So they just sent the winch, winch plates for now. So nothing too exciting there. Uh, Princess Auto, as always. Where's the Princess Auto box? There it is. This thing, this table is a complete mess. I gotta clean it off soon. But uh, I just, I was on the sales section just burning up money. So I bought a luggage, a luggage uh, scale. And I had a little adapter, half inch to uh, three eighths there. 
And I got some headphones for cutting lawns. So they're just the radio ones. Nothing too crazy. And then uh, we got some candy from uh, Sweet Smarts. So if you guys, or Smart Sweets, sorry. If you guys love candy but hate sugar, I definitely check these guys out. Their Instagram's right there. Smart Sweets. And they are just the best thing ever. So these are actually new. I've never tried these. These are, it looks like lollipops. So one gram of sugar in this whole bag. Or for, what is it? Oh, for two lollipops, sorry. That's still pretty good. One gram for two lollipops. So, And then they have the gummy bears, the worms, the peach rings. These are my favorite, these peach rings. So three grams of sugar for the whole bag, which is pretty amazing. Because I think if you ate a whole bag of normal candy, you're probably 50 to 100 grams of sugar. So gummy bears, we got watermelons, everything. Oh, and the fish. Don't forget the fish. So check them out, Sweet Smarts. Uh, I believe there's a link below if you want to check them out. And then the final thing, Olight. They've been with us for a long time. Best flashlights you'll ever use. I've been using them for three years now. They have a big sale starting the 28th, going till the 1st, I believe, 28th to 1st or 2nd. Uh, and, and up to 40% off on these two lights. I believe 20, 10 to 20% off on the website and 40% off for the Perun 2 and the M2R Warrior. So this is actually my favorite, the M2R Warrior. It's got a clip you can put it on your hat or whatever. Magnetic back for charging. Got all the different settings. Oh, I gotta pull the, pull the plastic out of this one still, but. Uh, yeah, so we have the Perun 2 as well and this little lamp thingy. And we also, they sent me a gun light. I don't have any guns, but my friends do. So pretty freaking fancy, super bright. And this one has the laser on it. So see that right there? Or you can switch it over to just the laser. So that's just a gun light if you want to check it out. That one's called the Galor. So let me pull the uh, plastic out of these and show you how bright they are. All right. So the M2R Warrior 2, got a nice sharp front in case you got to smash some glass. Magnetic back, which you can turn on the light with the back or use the button on the side. So there's three different modes, uh, low, medium, high, and super bright. So four different modes I meant. And then uh, you can do it on strobe too if you triple click it. So super bright, best lights in the league. Um, definitely check them out, link below. And yeah, remember 40% off on these two, up to 40% off. So huge sale starting 28th. Ah, haunted grudge. Uh, starting 28th to, I believe, the first or second. So check them out, Olight, best lights. All right, let's head down the track, play around with that Honda Civic, and end this video for the day and go have some more fun later. And back down the track. What's up, guys? So as you can see, we got a lot of rain on the weekend, it looks like. So... The driveway has washed up and the grass has grown, but I'm going to spray it and start cutting it. So we have my dad here. How's your trip? Oh, it was excellent. It was down in Costa Rica for a month. A month. I just took off for a month. No problem. <laughs> when it's dealing at the airport, coming back in with all the COVID tests. Was it a pain? Vaccinations, big, huge pain, but we did it. Yeah. Well, at least you got to travel. I went to, go. I went to Banff recently. That was, that was my trip. So. Anyways, Brad got his new uh, Dodge Durango, so we want to do a video on that today. And then we have some other stuff planned for this week, probably get some more cars. We're going to trim the track up, make it look nice again. And uh, yeah, so I figured let's get the F-150 out. No one's bought any parts of it yet. I'm still saving it for you guys if anyone wants doors off it, because they're not rusty at all. So I know everyone whines, why don't you sell some parts before you destroy it? So I'm holding on to it, holding out, but I'm going to jump it soon and destroy it, because... It's ready, so I'm gonna hop in it, rip through the puddle, mega burnout, and then we'll shut it down, cause you gotta get out of here, and I got stuff to do, so. All right, let's go fire it up. Okay, I think Mark's gonna push this car out of the way here. Let's see. Fire this thing up here. Hopefully there's nothing living in it. Ooh, that's loud.
got to give them a new name, Watermark. Watermark. All the water will be in This is leaks right through here. Where is it dripping? Well, there's no there's no seal on the window anymore, so the window's technically just sitting on here. She got a new nickname, Watermark. Watermark. <laughs> Watermark. I leave my mark That's a lot of smoke and a lot of rubber, Mark. It's good for the environment. Rubber, Mark. There's oh, another word. <laughs> Watermark and rubber, Mark. Have you been saving these up for the whole month? I don't know. I think so. <laughs> That's crazy. Question mark? Yeah, question mark. <laughs> well, when yeah. you were a little boy, it was magic marker. Magic marker. Magic marker. Some people still call me that. Bookmark? Uh, bookmark. <laughs> okay. Uh, all right, I'll steal his back from you. We're on wide. Nice little burn out there. Still saving this thing. It runs great. It's actually a really great track truck. That's kind of why I've been keeping it around. I don't really want to uh, really destroy it. Yeah. Mark, look at this. You burned the tread right into that. I know. Isn't that wood. funny? Look, 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 oh. look. And this one too. Look. That's funny. Right here. That one might be a little warm. That's awesome. Oh, it, can, it smells like burnt wood for sure. Oh, yeah. That's how you start a fire here. I guess. Uh, anyways. Thank you, Dad, for coming out. You're welcome. Hope Dad. you enjoyed yeah, your trip. I did. Uh, so, yeah, I think I'm going to come down now and start trimming the track, kind of get her back to the, the usual, because, you know, if you leave for a week, you come back, and it looks like this. So, <laughs> oh, man, wild. Anyways, have a fantastic day. Make sure to subscribe, leave some comments, and, uh, yeah, don't do anything we wouldn't do. We'll see you later. Bye-bye.